Okay, John the Van Guy. Um, RAV4 2007, common fault, the actual filler pipe, which runs from there, right down the back here, to down there. Uh, they leak, they rust and leak, so that's it. I've taken it out. How difficult is this job? Not that difficult. Um, you approach it correctly. Right, first of all, obviously, use all the safety precautions. Uh, jacking up the car and the stand. We've done all that. So take the tyre off, take the wheel off. And um, then we can see. Now, you, you'll have something like this there. Uh, which is about, I think there's about three bolts holding that on, and I think they're 12s. Um, and you'll see it there. There's one down there, there's one further up. Um, okay, uh, I'm not sure if it's onto the mountings or not. Okay, what you need to do, there'll be, there's a underneath here where the pipe goes let's get under there let's see a jubilee clip so that's a, a 10 mil uh, socket you'll need to get loosen that then you can work the pipe out from the bottom there uh, the bottom of the filler so that's the bottom of the filler once it's out well, you'll see how rusty it is what they tend to do is they they, they rust like mad and uh, you end up with pinhole, uh, pinholes in it, and uh, obviously you'll find you'll be leaking fuel. Uh, so okay, so you've got that off. You've exposed that. Now, when are you actually taking this off? This is the new one beside it. When are you actually taking this off? Uh, don't move these, the brackets. What you there's there will be a a nut holding um, or a bolt holding those in. And that bolt is a, is a, I'm not a remember, is a 12, 12 bolt. We'll be holding that into the, here. So I think that's probably is the 12 bolt there, actually. There's one further up. Now, the important thing is you don't take these off. The actual brackets themselves are found. You want to leave those on. Just undo the nut where it attaches to the body. I had two that I undid uh, because you'll need these spacings of the brackets you'll need to uh, mirror the spacings on your new part and this new part i bought from uh, ebay on ebay and it was about 47. Uh, i've measured it, it's exactly the same uh, what you'll notice is the brackets are in slightly different places so you've got to loosen uh, these brackets and position them accordingly uh, like they are on the original obviously so that everything should slot back and you'll find the correct holes once you've actually taken it out there you'll find there's the narrow pipe which is the goes in here which is in fact this pipe that's the overflow pipe which flows back into the tank there so so that's the overflow from the uh from the filler and uh, that goes in there so you just need something to clamp that clamp um to actually get out using a screwdriver or something to loosen it uh so you can actually get that out the whole thing will you'll find will pull off and it's not really attached to the top it only pushes up into there so you, the whole thing once you've taken it out from the bottom should just pull off so and you end up with that so you the next job really is to as i've said readjust the mountings to mirror the original uh, and then reverse <laughs> the takeoff procedure so that's it that's where i am um when you take doing the jubilee clip by the way uh use a 10 mil socket don't bother trying to unscrew uh, otherwise you'll be there for ages so a 10 mil socket on that will do it okay uh, I think that's all I can think of. Uh, best of luck. Now I must get on with it before it gets too late. Bye.